Hi, welcome back. Today, we're gonna go down south. Today we're making southern cornbread. Let's get started. Okay, so let's go through our ingredients list. I have a half a cup of Hudson Cream self-rising flour. I like Hudson Cream brand. You can use whatever self-rising flour you would like, but this always works good for me, and it's what my grandma and my mom always used. So, then I have two cups of uh, white cornmeal mix. I have two tablespoons of baking grease that I saved from breakfast this morning. And I actually saved a little more because we'll need some in our skillet. But this will go in our mix. And I have two cups of buttermilk. I have one egg, large egg a quarter teaspoon of salt, and a quarter teaspoon of sugar. I have preheated my oven to 450. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do, we're going to add our cornmeal. Now this is a cornmeal mix, a white cornmeal mix from Hudson Cream. And we're going to add our self-rising flour. We're gonna add our salt and our sugar. And we're gonna sift that together. So everything gets mixed up well. Now, we're gonna add our bacon grease. We're gonna add our large egg. Start adding, adding our buttermilk to our mix. We'll go ahead and add it all. Now, on the stove, you'll want to heat up a cast iron skillet with some bacon grease in it. And I'm just going to take my hand and mix the rest of this to make sure everything's mixed up good. Yep. Okay, so we have our heated oil. We don't want to burn our bacon grease, but we want it to sizzle as we put this in there. One bread in, you can see it sizzling. We're gonna spread this out, smooth that out really nicely. And the reason we want that frying is because that's gonna make us a nice, crispy crust around our cornbread. And there you go, we're ready for the oven. Okay, our cornbread is done. It baked for about 30 minutes. And you can see it's got a nice golden brown collar. And we let it cool for a second. Now we're just gonna flip it out. You can see that beautiful crust. And now, Let's plate it up.